Greetings, YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. The only way I do quote unquote Alliance War now is for free loyalty during the off season when I'll place a few champions and maybe I'll go in sometimes and attack. Maybe I won't. Uh, we know we're going to lose. It's just for loyalty. Loyalty is so valuable uh, in this game, especially after the buff of the loyalty store. But we, we have here Clips 27, his uh, Alliance War rewards video from the last season and just trying to really. Uh, See how much it's worth it. Now, you could argue that he should have waited and just opened most of these six-star crystals uh, when the new feature comes out. But if he doesn't have Apocalypse, he does not. This is why you play Alliance War. This is why you play Alliance War. I still don't want to do it. This is not changing my mind at all. But for somebody who maybe is looking to get some luck, that is insane. Let's see if the Nexus even comes close to that luck. And I mean... This is a fantastic Nexus, too. Apocalypse is wonderful, but Red Hulk, Manthe, and Black Hat, you can make an argument for all three of those champs. Personally, though, you know I'm biased. I'm hella biased toward Red Hulk. So let's see if he chooses who I'm biased uh, for or somebody else. Red Hulk? Maybe? Hopefully? Come on. I like all the choices here, but I chose him for defense, he says. I think that's a huge mistake. But what do I know? I'm just some rando in Oklahoma. You know? I don't. I don't really. My opinion doesn't matter that much. Okay, so Battleground solo event. Uh, he also got, ooh, 10,000 trophy tokens along with that. All the way to Gladiator Circuit. And got... Wow, another, was that 18,000 trophy tokens total? Bro, you're killing it. I finished just in the top 100,000 of summoners in Battlegrounds. Now, I probably should do more than three fights every two days if I care about it, but I really don't that much. I, I just don't. But hey, nice uh, tier 5 class cow selector. Also, Battlegrounds Alliance event, top 10%. That's nice. Claim that daily crystal. Six star six stones? No. Is that 21,000 trophy tokens too? That's crazy. I think that's such a ripoff for those, comparatively. Yeah, this is, this is better. He is purchasing... Whoa, 15,000 six star shards. Okay, make that 21,000? 20,000. Of course, if it was me, I would use every single one of them on the 50 six star six stones, but maybe he doesn't have anybody who wants to put six stones into. He is purchasing five star six stones. That's interesting. They're very cheap for 50, but you can also get them much easier than six star six stones. All right, now go going for, he can buy almost three. He says, mainly trying to get. Is it Cosmic Ghost Rider? He already got Apocalypse in this video. From a basic crystal. But remember, you got a 50-50 chance just to land on Cosmic Ghost Rider's class. Nevertheless, the champion himself. There's Omega Sentinel, there's Kamala Khan, there's Medusa, and at least it wasn't the University of Phoenix. Happy with this, he says. First time awakening? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Not too shabby. My Medusa is still not awakened. So, going back to the old featured crystal, appears so. Never mind. Two basics. Faked me out. You're trying to fake out the YouTuber again? Thanks, brother. First of two basic crystals. First one. OG Iron Man for all of those trophy tokens. Yikes. Thank God for the apocalypse at the beginning of this video because it has been fairly questionable since then. Alright, maybe this will turn it around. Maybe you'll awaken that apocalypse and... Mama Bear can be insanely jealous as she still has not awakened her apocalypse after, what, a couple years? Uh, 
All right. Read and weep. Crystal is slowing down, slowing down. And Overseer. I've seen several people say they love Overseer now for offense as much as defense, which is fascinating. So that's video number one of two. And this one, I guess, starts from where the last one stopped and then we have a third basic i mean the apocalypse obviously is the big takeaway from this video that is where the excitement is and it's slowing down it's slowing down it's slowing down and diablo or it's an agon sandwich be gone agon diablo is here have no fear and i gotta tell you He's in my rank four conversation. I love him, but I just don't use him that much. I wish I, I did. I love him every time I use him. But with the rank five Omega now, and still using rank four Sig 200 Hercules as much as possible, I just can't really justify Diablo in, unless we're talking about very specific situations. All right. Next six star basic. Hit monkey. Again. It's going to be two really awesome skill champions no matter what, and he did not have Agent Venom. So I, I think, objectively, God Monkey would have been better, but that's still very exciting. Look at all these back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back crystals, too. We're getting near the end of this video. I still think that Apocalypse is. What a story that is. Kingpin, Apocalypse again. Longshot, Carnage, and Jabari Parker slash Panther, just like Jabari Parker. Little disappointing career, but at the same time, still has done some damage. Okay. Well, let's go back to the beginning of this video because remember, this was all due at the beginning to those rewards. And I gotta say, bro. Pretty cool stuff, pretty exciting stuff. And it all concluded with this. That's the image, Clips 27. That's why you play this game, that's why you do Battlegrounds, that's why you do War, that's why you open it every day. By the way, I've got my uh, random She-Hulk shirt on, so if you're wondering, like, why is Prof uh, talking about justice? It's a She-Hulk shirt. By New Rock Stars. I'm a fan of New Rock Stars. I'm a fan of a lot of different YouTube channels, including my man Pat McAfee. All right, well, uh, thanks for watching. Have a good one, and hope you all are having a fantastic weekend.